I want you to imagine a golden ball of light above your head. This golden ball of light represents the loving energy of the universe. Now imagine the ball's loving energy slowly flowing down through the top of your head, down through your neck. Take a deep breath and pull the energy in. Now slowly release your breath. Again, breathe deeply and pull the loving energy in through your head and neck and into your shoulders. Slowly release your breath, letting your tensions go with it. Take another deep breath. Pull the loving energy into your lungs and chest. Let it flow throughout your arms. See the light shoot from your hands. Slowly release your breath. Again, take a deep breath and pull the loving energy in. Let it flow into your stomach and hips and root chakra. Now release your breath. Take another deep breath. Pull the loving energy into your legs, deeper and deeper until the golden light reaches your feet, letting the loving energy flow into the earth, the floor beneath you, to help ground you. Release your breath. Finally, let the loving energy flow down from the ball, the golden ball, and let it flow all around you. Envision it encircling your body, providing warmth, love, and protection. Keep breathing. Deep, deep breaths. Now I will guide you to find your power animal. Think of a place outdoors that you consider to be paradise. A place where you have wonderful memories, or have always envisioned yourself being happy. A place where you feel safe. It can be at the beach, a cabin in the woods, or on top of a mountain. No matter where it is, this is the most special place on earth that you can imagine. Now I want you, in your mind, to go to this happy place. Immerse yourself in the surroundings. Feel the ground beneath your feet. Look at the sky above you. Listen to the sounds. Be totally there. A white mist is rolling towards you like an ocean wave. This great wall of mist surrounds you and everything becomes white. Although you cannot see your surroundings, you are safe. I want you to begin walking through the mist, one footstep, then another, knowing each footstep is secure. Keep walking, relax. It's okay to not know what's ahead. It's okay to trust the universal powers. Keep walking. The mist is lifting. You see the sun peeking through. You come to the edge and you step out of the mist. You have entered a forest. In front of you is a broad tree filled with birds in its branches. Walk towards it until you see a small rabbit hole near its roots. The hole is small and round, but as you approach, the hole becomes bigger, growing in size until it's large enough for you to fit inside. I want you to stand at its edge and peer down. You see a long tunnel. You're not sure where it leads, but you can feel the earth's center calling to you. Gather your courage and jump into the hole. Slide down this long and winding tunnel.
let yourself fall deeper and deeper. Let yourself slide down and down. There is a faint light at the end. As you fall, you come closer to it. You are nearing the end of the tunnel, which is very bright. You merge into the light and become totally immersed in its warm glow. You lose yourself in this loving energy. The light fades away and you discover that you are outside the rabbit hole. You have entered the lower level of the spirit realm. Here is an old forest with sunlight streaming through the canopy. Ahead of you is a path. Follow it and enter this magical place where the ancient trees possess all the knowledge since the beginning of time. Follow the path. Walk in the shade. A breeze shakes the leaves. The path leads you to the edge of the forest near a cliff overlooking the ocean. You hear the roar of the waves below. Suddenly, from out of the forest behind you, dozens of creatures appear, moving toward you. Some are walking, others are flying, slithering, or swimming toward you. All of them are happy to see you. These creatures, which are power animals, surround you to welcome you. They are happy to see you. They have waited a long time to meet you. Take a moment to greet them. The animals begin to slip away one by one. They continue to leave until only one is left. This remaining power animal looks at you and you look at it. You wonder if this is the one. To find out, you ask, are you my power animal? And then see how it responds. If it happens to leave, see if it returns soon or if another power animal appears. If it stays, I'll give you a few minutes to talk with your power animal. If it is left, I'll let you see if it returns. Uh, if it has left, just continue walking on the path and then see what appears. If your power animal has stayed or returns in a few minutes, I want you to ask it what words of wisdom it offers you.
Now that you have interacted with your power animal, I want the two of you to walk back on the path that you came in on, back into the forest, back toward the rabbit hill. Take in the beauty as you walk along. At this moment, you are perfectly connected to the universe and all that it contains. Up ahead, you see the rabbit hole. Walk towards it. When you reach the rabbit hole, face your power animal and tell it how grateful you are that it has chosen you and for its continued support as you move forward in life together. It is time for you to return back to ordinary reality. And although your partner will stay here in the spirit realm, a connection has been created between the two of you. Your power animal's archetype energy will help you here in ordinary reality. Say goodbye. Now jump. Jump into the rabbit hole. Let yourself fly up through the tunnel. Keep going until you find yourself back where you started, back at your favorite place. Take a long, deep breath. Then exhale. Slowly wiggle your hands and feet. Open your eyes when you are ready. From this point, you can call on your power animal when you need its archetype energy. It's often easier to go through life when you know that there is someone beside you who has your back, who is always there to offer support that is for your best and highest good. So you can also Google uh, the meaning of your power animal, and there are several good books, such as the one by Ted Andrews, um, that offer great advice. Um, on power animals. So thank you, and I wish you the very best and blessed journeys.